live? We live, ready and direct. Hey! All right, y'all. This is a good day. I'm bringing some good energy, man. It's been a long week for me. It's been tough, but I'm about to just... I'm excited right now. I got a lot of stuff right here I'm about to show y'all. So first off, let me start off with... Uh, I got a bunch of shout outs, so I, I ain't trying to forget nobody. First of all, shout out to my brother, Mike Will, for holding it down on the packs, man. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Because, man, you know how that go. That's a lot. You're right, bro. That was a lot. <laughs> he also my cameraman today. So, yes, y'all shouting out G-Body Dreams. Y'all know what it is. Y'all know what it is. It's on the channel. Y'all go keep checking it out. We're going to keep running that up. Because it ain't over for me and it ain't over for him. We still rolling. Um, shout out to uh, Grind School. Shout out to Grind School out there in Denver, Colorado. Those uh, raffle giveaways, they legit, man. I didn't think they was legit. I be, I, I shelled out some money a couple times, and uh, I lost. But if you win, you really win. You know what I'm saying? And this one was a free raffle. He was going off of uh, comments, the comment section. Uh, so I, I watched his video. And spent, the spin wheel was spinning, and it really selected my name. He really hit me up. He hit me on Instagram, and he hit me, uh, and he hit me on YouTube. So y'all go check his channel out. It's called Grind School on YouTube. Uh, same way I think is his uh, Instagram page, Grind School. Grind School 1. I think it's like underscore 1 or something like that. But y'all look through my page. Y'all see his. Uh, y'all see some of his stuff. I'm going to start. Uh, I'm gonna post him up on there. And y'all can uh, go off my hashtag and catch up with him. Out of Denver, Colorado. I want some Super 40 uh, Exhaust uh, Flowmasters. And uh, he paid for the shipping. Everything was legit. All he said was, bro, give me your address. And I'm going to send it to you. No BS. He sent me the tracking number. Everything was legit. Now, as far as these cars go, I'm sure they are legit. I know one person that did win a whole car. He is in Las Vegas, Nevada. When I get up there, we're going to talk about his car when I go out there. But he did win a whole car. So these raffles and giveaways are legit. Y'all get in on that. And if you win, you win. If you lose, you lose. But it's all right. Most of the time, you don't spend a lot of money. Like, don't do what I did. I spent a lot of money and I lost. <laughs> so... Take your chances and get in where you fit in, you know, but I did want to wrap up. I'm going to show y'all that over there, too. That's on the um, on the prize Christmas stand right there. Um, shout out to my boy, Blando Bands. This is his merch right here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, not for the weak hearted. I really ain't even studied it too much. I'm just now getting it, but it's so fresh. I just threw it on. You know what I'm saying? So y'all check that out. Not for the weak hearted. Y'all see he got the, y'all see he got the ski masses to go with it. Nice size hoodie. You know, it's, it's, it's good material. It's real, real deal legit. So y'all check him out, man. He rap. He rap and do his thing. Uh, good dude, man. Out of uh, Phoenix, Arizona. He's he an upcoming artist. Good dude, man. So y'all want uh, QR codes, business business cards, QR codes with the scan on them, uh, T-shirts, and hoodies. And ski masks, man. Probably a bucket hat, too. I want a bucket. I'm going to see if you can make me a bucket hat. Shout out to my boy Bleezy down there in BR, man. Shout out to my people in Louisiana. As always, always taking care of me, man. Um, he sent me a pack. I got that in the mail, Big Bleezy. Appreciate you, big dog. Uh, little swap, little mix up in the mail or whatever, but I definitely got that. It's over there on the table. And uh, shout out to my boy Frankie for always helping me, man. He helped me with a few of those orders on the table. Y'all know my boy Frank always behind me no matter what. Appreciate that, big bro. Helps help me with some of them orders, man. My brother Mike Will, of course, he helped me with some of them orders, picking that shit out. <laughs> the rest of that is all me. I was going crazy, man. I've been going in two jobs at a time, no stop, barely any sleep. I've been grinding, grinding, grinding so I can shine, shine, shine all summer, man. So let's get into it. Let me take y'all over to the tables, so let y'all see what's happening. All right. First box, like I said, my boy Bleezy from down there in Louisiana, man, down there in BR, man. Appreciate you, big dog. You know how we rocking. I'm going to come back and see you soon, big bro. You know what's up. He hooked me up with the... It might look simple to you, but it's power packed right here. He uh, hooked me up, man. He gave me 600-something uh, plus songs on here, man. 600-something songs. So now I can finally get rid of all them CDs out of my old school. I ain't got to have no more CDs, and I ain't got to keep, you know, flipping and changing, flipping and changing at the stoplight. You know how it go. So now I finally got a USB. Um, we only missing one package. Or two packages actually out of this group. We missing some uh, G body uh, lift spindles, the two to three inch lift spindles, and we missing my uh, my radio because I just ordered that today. And the radio, it's like a little seven inch flip screen. 
Y'all see that when I start putting the video up for the car anyway. Y'all need to really see my car anyway and like really see what's going on. Because the video I had for my car is like a year old. That was just like a slideshow. That was just bringing you into the, to the you know what I'm saying. But I done put in so much work since then. I'm going to give y'all a whole big ass update video. Like it's going to be legit. So he hooked me up with the USB. I can plug that up to my new TV screen. Thank you, my boy, please. Appreciate that. And he gave me an authentic. This is that country right here. This is that country living right here. Authentic cowhide belt. Authentic right here. You know, size 42. That's for the big boys. You know what I'm saying? We ain't no 36 no more. That's for the big boys. <laughs> so, yeah, real deal. Authentic cowhide. Real nice. Y'all might hear about, talking about them in the country in the rap songs. You know, got my cowhide. Belt in my wrestler's on or something like that, you know. Listen to them country boys. Y'all hear that music. So, got the real deal right here because we, we country living how we like to do it. Sit that right there. Woo hoo! Packs on packs. What? Hey, 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 Mike, what you call me? Blanta. <laughs> <laughs> the Black Santa. Blanta is here. You know what I'm saying? And that's another thing. Ho, 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 Merry Christmas, all that good stuff. You know, Happy New Year, y'all, whatever, you know, whatever y'all celebrate, you know. Ain't no Santa Claus sliding down this chimney. This I had to pay for all this. So shout out to my people down there in the South, man, like I said before. I just hollered my boy Bleez. Now I got the book bag to go with it, big bro. I'm going to put all my, all my new information for next year in here. I'll keep me a book bag. I'll keep me a file with all my stuff, you know. So now I got that on deck, brand new, fresh out. Yeah, I'm straight with this. And it's got space. I got plenty of space for these straps. You know, I'm going to loosen that up. But, yup, we good, though. Now my LSU gear is complete. Got the whole sweatsuits. Got the uh, got the hoodies. Uh, got the socks. My whole LSU gear is basically complete. Got the keychain. The keychain ain't on me today, but got the keychain. Got it all for LSU, man. So I can LSU down at any day. Hit the game. All right, y'all. This is the giveaway box. Ooh, put him down so it's the giveaway box. Ooh, he made sure we was strapped up, didn't he? He strapped us all the way up. He double sided tape. Damn. Denver, Colorado. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh yeah. Oh yes, sir. I don't even know how much these is uh hot rod speech parts hall of fame. That's how you know they legit. You know what? I really don't even know how much these cost, man. How much you think these cost by themselves, Mike? Mm, shit, maybe like 130 bucks a maybe. piece. Yeah. Okay. So, so this they is they uh they Flowmaster for Super 44s Super right here. Oh, Super 44. Super 44 series. Oh, so these I think these I think these are upgrade for mine because I think I got be this, real nice. I think this I got the gotta Super be, 40. It's like got an aggressive sound. It's nice. I'm gonna have to check the uh the Flowmaster listing, but I'm pretty sure I got the uh just the basic Super 40s then. Wow, and they brand new. Brand mm -hmm. new, untouched. Y'all, don't worry about the dust, y'all. Just know that they brand new out the box with the official copyright stamp on them boys. Yes, sir. Grind school. I'm just letting you know that I got it, man. I appreciate you, big bro. That's, that was legit right there. You know what I'm saying? I really, really, really appreciate that. I'm going to go back on the Flowmaster list and see if I got the Super 40s, and then I'm going to see if these is just... A level higher than mine. I'm gonna check and see. And if they a level higher than mine, you know I'm about to swap them out. <laughs> Cause mine's is brand new too. On my uh, on my Monte Carlo. So that's the big boy box. Let's get him out the way. Let's make some space. Hey y'all, this video gonna be a little bit drawn out, a little long, but hey, this that money right here. Some tenant license plates. You need these in Arizona. Forget what the police talking about. I don't know how illegal they are or whatever. But when your license plates and stuff be fading. Go get y'all some of these. I've seen some cars roll by me. They got them. You know what I'm saying? I guess the police don't really care too much. They don't care about window tent. My window tent, crazy dark. So got me some license plate covers to go with that. Uh, you know, just to fade and, you know, keep people out your business. You know what I'm mean? saying? Yeah, man. Just a little bit. Help me here. These are the exhaust manifolds. Exhaust manifolds. For the gaskets. So the gaskets. And, and they copper, boys. So... Better protection yes, from sir. Me. Yes, sir. You know, go ahead and spend that extra couple dollars, y'all. For you know, they look good too. I really like the way they look. Go ahead and spend that couple extra dollars, y'all, for better protection. They look like they thicker too. They are. Yeah, yeah they're, they're. You they're, can tell. They don't feel as. Uh, I bought some from AutoZone, the Pro Fields or whatever, and they was a little flimsy. Fail Pro. Fail Pro. There you go. And they was a little flimsy. I do remember that. 
So these these feel more, mm -hmm. mm, more solid, more sturdy. I like that. I like that. Uh, these are from the Lift Kit kind of you can call them Lift Company. The Lift, uh, the Universal Lift Company out of Minnesota, Minneapolis. So y'all know how this go. Y'all seen the books. Y'all y'all remember how these installation forms stuff like that. So. We got the new front springs. Pick it up in the front. Pick the car up in the front. Because if y'all know, y'all got y'all motors in there. It sagged down a little bit. So you want to be able to pick it up. You know, more compression, more weight is what I was told on the phone. So the car won't sag down as much. And that's how you get your, get your lift out of it. So these was not cheap either, y'all. These was not cheap, man. I'm not lying. I don't even want to say how much I spent. <laughs> so y'all get in these comments. Don't ask me about no prices. I'm not telling y'all nothing. <laughs> <laughs> just know this is a this is a tell big, them to go build a car themselves and they'll find out very quickly how right, much it costs right right there it goes just, <laughs> just go start now. and then go send start. it to g body dreams when you're ready we yes, got sir. you yes sir there you go and he'll tell you what to order <laughs> hell super sport restoration kj he'll tell you what to order you know what i'm saying he'd be like hey you need this 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 and this and you're gonna be mad when that list come back you'd be like hey man what else do i need i thought it was all complete we got some suspension pieces. This is a 14 uh, a fourteen kit combo. Y'all can see through the plastic. Crack it open, shit. Ah, crack them open, crack them open. Why not? You know, suspension, steering links, all type of stuff. They, they, like I said, they already greased up too. They ready for, they ready for some work, ain't they? He said, you still gotta grease them anyway. Yeah, these the same right here. Man, everything new, y'all. Everything new. You can't cut no corners when you're doing a restoration. Just, just buy it, man. I know it'd be hard. I know, I know y'all be tired of going to work and putting in overtime and y'all grinding to get it. Just buy it, man. It's a one-time buy. You know, depending how hard you're going, if you want UMI and all that crazy stuff. But it's a one-time buy. Just buy it, y'all. Y'all see this stuff? I know y'all see this stuff, man. Just buy it. You know. Look, look how clean that is. Just cop, man. Just cop. Just cop and go. Just cop and go. Wow, that's a, that's a heavy ass box, too. I didn't you so imagine what the front weight feel like on the car. Because that's a nice little. Ooh, wee. Shit, plus an engine. Yeah, plus an engine, right? <laughs> wee. All right, child. This is like a big old Xbox or something. Woo! Looky, 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 looky. Oh, yeah, it's already open. Look, he said, "Don't cut me up. I'm already open." Wow, wow, a blast from the past. These are definitely 1986 right here. You're looking at brand new from 1986. Stock component, stock, uh, stock piece. But hey, you know anything is better than used. Shit, new is better than used if you ask me. And that's the second one right there. Use the uppers, right? Those are the lowers. These are the lowers? Okay. The yep, spring sits in here. Let's well, see. Look, y'all see it. And the spring sit right in there. Y'all heard the man. Wow. Those, these are really nice. And they, like I yeah, said, another yep. heavy piece. Yep. So imagine what it feel like when you're putting that weight on the car, y'all. You know, that's a, that's a good box right there. I like that. That's a good box. I'm, so, I'm seeing most of the stuff for the first time, y'all. So I'm just as surprised as y'all are. If y'all ain't, I am for you. How about that? Because <laughs> it's mine. Oh, they're going to other blades. Just looking for that, man. Look at that. Look, uh, let's go samurai. <laughs> let's go samurai. I said it was under one of these other buttons. Let's go samurai on Why? What's this? It's like that uh, the fuel pressure regulator I bought. Yep. Fuel well, pump. Fuel pump, though. So this is a different brand. This was uh, my boy Frank. This was one of his suggestions to go with my new gas tank. This my new gas tank ain't here. But I'll bring that, like I said, when the car comes. Uh, so the new fuel pump, all these different pieces. Y'all see how it go? They go with that. They go. So now I'm gonna have a um electric fuel pump. So I guess I'm gonna still have to tap on the gas a little bit to start it up, but not as much no more because now I got I got fuel flowing. You know, let it prime. Turn the key twice. Let it prime. Boom. It'll make it even better. Now shout out to shout out to uh Super Sport Restorations because uh. My tune-up job is amazing. I can let that car sit for months and it's still gonna fire up. So this is just an add-on to, you know, 
what I had done to the car already. This is just an add-on, y'all. If you get a good tune job with a regular little carburetor, you'll be fine. Especially if it's your daily, you'll be fine. You'll be perfectly A-OK. -okay. Ah, here we go. This, this is it. This is it right here. Just go with it too, y'all. Part of the electric fuel pump set up. He said keep it at a uh, seven psi when I was talking to him about seven psi, something like that. When you when you tune this, that's all the little hardware to go with it. Little little rope of dope, fuel, little baby, little fuel lines, stuff like that. This is man, that's a, that's a nice little piece too. I really like the way that looks. Frank, there's that another Frank suggestion, especially with the colors. He know I like blue, so he sent it to me, my boy Frankie, man. He know, he know what I like, man. He, he was like, yeah, look at this one. He sent it right on to me. I was like, man. He's like, you don't got a choice. You might as well buy it. <laughs> <laughs> he be playing with me, man. He be knowing what he be doing. What else we got here? Ooh, I remember this. Okay. My overflow tank. Now, if you have an original one from Mike's Monty's and stuff like that, that's okay. But they got these on Amazon for 35 bucks. I'm going to tell you our price on this. 35 bucks is what this costs right here. And look how nice it is. And it's smaller than the stock one that go in G-Bodies. Look how nice this is, man. And look, you can see the little, if it go through there or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on now. You know, look at the welds on it. Nice little weld marks. Look at that, man. Good detail. And look, you can see right on through it, too. Clean. Clean. Give it a little easy screw on, easy screw off. Look at that. And it's compact. I really like that. And then you can hide it away somewhere. You can tuck it in the corner. Look, there go the motor. You can tuck that in the corner right there somewhere or something and let it flow through. You know, stuff like that. You can get creative. It give you more space. More space, more options. I like stuff like that. That's pretty cool. I'm pretty glad I found that. I forgot how I found that. I think I... It was me. Oh, it was you again? <laughs> yeah, it was you again. I think I mentioned you the idea because I seen it on somebody else's car. And I was like, hey, how do I find one of those? And you sure did. Dangerous. This was you again right here, big bro. This was you all day. So now I can see my water temperature, which I do got a new water pump and stuff like that. My battery volts. I'm going to buy a new battery. Uh, that Duralast Gold. So, you know, that's going to be like 14. And then uh, now I can see my oil pressure. You know what I'm saying? And I never knew what my oil pressure was. So now we got the new gauges. They they do light up. You can, uh, we're going to put some lights in there and change it. They're going to be like white in the background. But you see how clean those are, though? Real clean, man. See that box really got in there. That was a, that was a man. Clean, y'all. I'm going to wire it all up nice and easy install. It's going to sit right below my radio. So while I'm messing with my radio, you know, playing with the USB, I can check my little stuff at the light, you know, while you're sitting at the lights. And while you're tuning, stuff like that, you know, stuff. Stuff that you can see. You ain't just running the motor and you don't know you good. You can you can trust your trust your instinct now. You can read it. You ain't gotta go off the instinct. I like that. I like stuff like that. I'm trying to make a 1986 into a 2023. Can y'all understand where I'm going with this? <laughs> Cause that's where we at right now. Ho, ho, ho. Uh, yeah, if y'all remember my if y'all remember my car, y'all remember that I got a big screen TV in there. Not a 24 inch. But this is a power converter so that my TV can work. So that way it's feeding energy off my battery into this, into the TV. And then the same way you plug a TV into the wall is the same way you plug it up in here. It's got a top power plug. Oop, plug it right on up in there. That's what you just like that. Look. Perfect. Just like that. Take your household power to the road. <laughs> I didn't even see that they put that on there. That's crazy. So yeah, we got this. This is definitely a key piece, especially when I uh, redo my TV again, because now I got a... Uh, that, and that's what, I, that's what I bought that USB for. So now this time I got a smart TV. Back then I had a regular, regular, you know, click remote TV. Now I got a smart TV. I can just do stuff off my phone. I ain't got to have out on CDs and stuff no more. Y'all know I'm big on CDs. I did buy a CD book. That's not here. I got a CD book now. I'm about to put all that stuff up. And uh, now I can uh, get back to it. I got a Vizio TV now. And that Vizio is going to be real nice. Go. Yep. All right. So I got a little confused on this, but I don't think we're going to use these. These are LED bulbs. HID LED bulbs. 
I don't think I'm gonna end up using these because the set of headlights that I'm gonna get, they already built in. So I don't think I'm I don't think I'm gonna need this. So, but we're gonna keep them just in case, you know, maybe for another car, something like that. But these brand new out the box, y'all see it. I think these is these didn't cost too much. I think I got these off offer up anyway, for real, for real. I'm pretty sure, I think. Or I might have bought them. I had them for a while. They've been sitting in the stash, as you can see. The box look kind of dusty, so these have been in the stash. But I think I did order these. Either something or offer up or something like that. But I don't think I'm going to use them, but we got them just in case for another car. This was sitting in the stash also. Viper alarm system. Brand new. All the wires, all the wiring. Stuff like that. Alarm horn. You know, you need stuff like that. These are my fog lights. I think they got bigger ones by now, AutoZone. So we might go ahead and upgrade these to the bigger ones, almost like the truck style. So they'll sit in there nicer. Cause uh, I'm gonna line them up to the face of the 86 out there and see how they gonna sit in there. Uh, so I think we can upgrade and get the bigger ones. And uh, instead of turn signals and uh, front lights, park lights in the front of my money, I'm gonna go ahead and put some lights down there cause I want them to shine nice and bright. Yeah, see it, look. Viper alarm, beep, beep. That battery probably need to get changed after all. This was sitting in the stash too, but it's brand new. Yeah, that battery ain't. Yeah, we gonna have to change that battery. But yep, that's ready to go also, cause I got the other one on my keys, on my other keys now. Control box. Yep, got the other light. So I should be able to find the bigger ones at AutoZone. We gonna, we gonna line those up. I'm glad I pulled that out. Let me set that to the side real quick. Box. Uh, did we go through this already? Mm -hmm. Why are you on the, on the fuel floor? pump? Yeah, fuel pump. Why are you on the floor? Get out of here. Aha! Now this is good. Yes, Sersky. Yes, Sersky. Why do I feel like it was bigger than this? Is it a piece missing? Or am I tripping? Nah, the fuel pump goes right here. Right, 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 okay. And then I'm the like, sock goes on the bottom. Okay, because I'm like, I know there's a piece missing. Nope. Nope, okay, good. So, I do remember how much this costs, but like, again, I'm not telling y'all. <laughs> Go build one. But for the electric fuel pump, it's all here. Y'all see it. Brand new. Uh, I forgot what brand it was. I would have told y'all, but I forgot what brand it was. Oh, they're going to float. That's the float for it, for sure. Uh, what brand? I forgot. I don't know what brand that was. But yep, there it is. This was another Amazon order, as always. Uh, suggested by my boy Frank because he has an LS swap going on that I still got to show y'all. And uh, this is part of his fuel system that he gave me some free game on. So once again, my boy Frank, appreciate you, big bro. Oh, buddy, what do we have here? Okay. Now, this is the box that confused me from the other one. So, these are... Wow. Man, these are nice. Okay, can you explain what we're looking at here? So, those are the upper control arms. What we looked at in the last box over was the there, lower. where the lower ones, those right. are on top. Man, these got some weight on them, y'all. Yeah, they're nice. Ball joints included. Man, look how sturdy that look. I know the other ones, the upgraded, the UMIs, they'd be a little thicker and stuff like that. But these are pretty sturdy, man, from, from back in the day to new school. Yeah, we'll grab some new bolts when we install those, too. That way, those are nice and shiny, too. Uh, they normally don't center. Right now, the ones that go right here. Oh, okay. Some, bet, we'll bet, bet, nice bet. I didn't even see Grade that Grade 8 bolts. I like that, man. I didn't even see that gap right there, but I like that. So, yeah, that's, that's the right side. And it wouldn't be right if we didn't open the left side. Just to make sure it's official. I'm like a referee for this. Let's double check. Just to make sure they ain't play us. Oh wow, look at that, y'all. Look at that, look at that. Hmm. That was unexpected. All right. Well, Ten dollars off. I'll take that. I don't even door dash much, but hey. Maybe delivery. I'll give it away. Maybe That's... that'll be a giveaway. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and this is 
the other side. So Y'all see how crispy these is. Ooh, a little chip chip. No worries though. I don't really care about that. Maybe you think uh, on the shelf at the, uh, where you sell them at? Oh, you can just little throw chip. some little satin primer on, satin, some satin yeah. paint on there, clean them up. Yeah. No big deal. See that? This is why y'all always check y'all packages as soon as y'all open them, y'all. Because you don't know what to expect. So, I always check whatever they send you. But not bad, though. A little scratch mark, I guess. Wherever they was at previously is where all these little skips and scuffs came from. But no worries. It don't probably matter. somebody tossing it at the front door. Yeah, probably, too. <laughs> yeah, that too. But as long as I got what I need, I don't care. <laughs> it's brand new and it's better than what's old. And what is this? A cotter pin oh. for right here. The ball joint. Oh, okay, okay. Wow. So, in conclusion, like I said, shout out to my people in the South. Shout out to my people in Colorado for helping me out, plugging me on that, uh, on Flowmasters. Um, they will get used, like I said. Shoot, they gonna get used somehow. Believe me, big bro. Um, man, it was a few boxes. I know it was a lot. But that's it costs to be the boss, y'all. Like that's that's just what it is. It costs to be the boss, bro. And if I could say how much hard work I put in for it, y'all wouldn't believe me, man. I'm talking about day and night, up, up and at it, up and at it, up and at it, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I didn't give up on myself. Y'all don't give up on y'all self. Y'all keep making it happen, man. And uh, as my boys say, stay wrenching, stay dreaming, cause uh, that's what it take. That's that's like what it take. It take a dream, and it take action. You can sit there and make comments on YouTube all day about what somebody else got. But until you have to go through it and build it yourself, you'll never understand. And you'll never you'll never appreciate the price that they selling it for. Oh, I can get so-and-so out of that. I can get this for this and that. No, you can't. That man said what he said, and that's how much it costs pain. <laughs> Long story short. That's the best way I can explain it, man. Because look at this. This is this is hard work and dedication right here, y'all. Like it's 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 not a game. So Shout out to all the companies that I spent hard-earned money with. Uh, appreciate that for the control arms. Oh, these was, we ordered that off eBay, so I really can't say what company they came from. Um, like I said, the only thing missing is the spindles and the radio. And I thought about doing some upscale stuff. I thought about getting a, uh, a rear view mirror that already be mm -hmm. uh, yeah, having a camera on for, it. For the backup, yeah. Yeah, I think I want one of those, man, just to upgrade my rear view yeah, mirror and go sure. ahead and get that stuff out of there. So I think I'm going to order that too. And that's pretty much it for real, man. I think I I think I think did it all, brother. The brakes and rotors already new, so no worries there. We just got to paint up under there and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to get this frame off job done sometime next year. That's next. I'm going to pull it off the frame, get this frame box notched and powder coated. Uh, and like I said, y'all gonna see all this stuff coming, man. I know y'all want to see what I'm working with, but it ain't a secret. It ain't a joke either. I'm really putting in the work. Like, it ain't no secret. I ain't got nothing from y'all. It's just putting in the work to do it and actually finding time to shoot the video and make everything happen. So y'all stick around, man. Y'all been sticking around. Subscribers been going up. Videos been going up. Um, y'all make sure y'all stay active, stay healthy, wash your hands still, all of that good stuff. Uh... Man, we we are out here, man. That's about it. That's all I got. Appreciate my boy Mike Will on the camera on the ones and twos. And uh, shoot, man, that's it. Y'all, when I bring the car here, we'll go ahead and get started with a small light video on that, like a before and after type of deal, maybe. And um, I'm gonna show y'all some more stuff on what he working on, man. Cause I ain't, I ain't, I've been, I've been hustling so hard, I ain't even been shooting. So I gotta get back to it, pick up speed, let y'all catch up. There's some new locations, some new people to meet. I got a lot of stuff coming for the channel, so. Y'all stick around, man. Y'all stick around for sure. Uh, this summer coming up, should be traveling. Should be, like I said, my boy in Colorado should be getting at him. My boy in Louisiana going to be getting at him. My uh, my boy, uh, Big Dan, go up there in Vegas, check on him. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's a few good people on, on Instagram I met too in Vegas. I got to get at, man. I ain't forget about y'all. But we going to say that, though. So everything coming soon, everything coming my way, and that's just how it's going. Peace.